Amukweo says the decision was made by the Onipa District Executive Committee, which recommended Nangolo's suspension to the Regional Executive Committee. It is alleged that Nangolo colluded with the Independent Patriots for Change IPC during the November Council elections. The Swapo Party holds four seats on the Onipa Council, while IPC holds the remaining three seats. According to documents in NBC's possession, the council allegedly refused to caucus with fellow party members prior to the council elections, where it was decided that the then incumbent mayor, Hileni Idogela, would again be nominated for the position. However, Nangolo was nominated and seconded by IPC councillors. He accepted the nomination and he got elected following a secret ballot. He then also nominated an IPC member to take the deputy mayoral position. All Swapo councillors were under instruction not to collaborate or go into alliance with IPC. The Swapo District Executive Committee then recommended to the Regional Executive Committee that Nangolo be recalled from the council as he acted contrary to party instructions and collaborated with IPC, embarrassing Swapo party, and three of his fellow councillors. The regional executive in a letter to party SG, Sophia Shaningwa, unanimously recommended for Nangolo to be recalled from the council and be replaced by the next person on the party list. The letter to Nangolo also reads that Nangolo should not communicate about any issue linked to the Swapo party. This week, some supporters of Nangolo staged a demonstration calling for his reinstatement. Contacted for comment, party SG Sophia Shaningwa says she is out of the country and cannot comment on the matter prematurely. Ndapandashuya, NBC News. Oshakati.